show you if you look into Pringle's uh, twist, the shape of the twist is not flat. It's actually engineered to be in that particular shape so that it can maintain a certain uh, attribute, which is the crispiness. And also, uh, the name of that shape, if it looks like a satellite shape of the crisp. Okay, and that is actually hyperbolic paraboloid, whereby if you have that, uh, when they stack uh, the crisp in the tube, it will not uh, slide on, on top of each other. If, if you can imagine, you have a flat window and you just keep on, on top of each other, it's very hard for them to do the, the, the large scale production. So we have this kind of design so that it makes it easier and it is uh, the, the, the operating of uh, the production of that window would be easier. Okay, and if you notice, is it break? The crease will not break in symmetrically, it just breaks chips everywhere. And this is because of this type of um, shape. So when you know your ingredients for food, you can do and design and innovate uh, anything. And you can control how you want the final product looks like. So that's the reason we need to understand our ingredients and our product because it will actually relate and feed back to the food safety as well as the quality of the product that you are producing because you can control the product, the manufacturing of the product. 